Alright, what is good everybody on YouTube? As you can already tell from the title of what exactly we're going to get into today. So, we got the I'm on my year fours in today. And as you know, if you've been you've been on the channel, you know I have yet to miss on a I'm on my year drop. I'm pretty blessed, but I'm not going to hold you guys up. We're going to dive into the shoes, get into the quality, the materials, talk about different aspects of it, and then wrap this video up and you can go about your day. So let's get right into it. All right. So first you have the I'm on my year box. Almost every single pair that they've dropped has this I'm on my year covering on it. It's nice, glossy, all A's across the whole box itself. There is the size tag. As you know, this is a personal so it's 11 and a half that's what the tag is going to read there outside of that we take the sleeve off we're gonna sit this to the side in the back we'll leave that back there for now but you have the I'm on my year box so you have I'm on my years logo there other side just jump man air I'm on my year you have the speckle print here on the side of the box and you have that size tag once again but Soon as you pop that top here, you're introduced with a photo of Jordan. It's a lot easier to see on camera, but you can kind of see Jordan here jump in and, you know, kind of hitting one of them moves. Uh, I forgot which game it was. You can look it up yourself, but that is what's on the box cover with that I'm on my year logo. That is the box top. Don't need that anymore. Got the paper here. I'm on my year logos all around. And when you flip it back, you have I'm on my year fours. All right, so we have the I'm on my year fours outside of the box. And hopefully with this lighting, you can kind of get a grasp of how the color is of the shoe. Kind of hard to tell because in different pictures, this can seem like a brown, but it is like a very, very brownish purple. The name of the shoe is Violet Ore because it does have hints of pink or purple, kind of like how the I'm on my year threes had it on the midsole there, like where this would normally be. It had that color embedded on the side, but this is the I'm on my year fours. You have a complete suede overlay of the shoe on the hang tag here you do have this i'm on my year tag it says that with the jumpman logo on the front and the back side so it's going to look like that on both sides the shoe itself the suede is in really good you can kind of tell some of the wrinkles and stuff like that outside of the box there you may not be able to see it on camera but it's kind of smooth to the touch nice material in my opinion it may vary just depending on the quality control of other people's pairs but i did get a decent pair on the side of the shoe here you see this pin here that is going to have that i'm on my year logo right there so that is on both of the shoes and the back heel which I feel like is a nice touch kind of gives you more sense of it being a more a more of a high class sneaker it kind of has that pin kind of give you a feel of that next we're going to get into the tongue of the shoe so on both of the tongues on this Air Jordan 4 you have the I'm on my year logo on one part of the tongue and then on the other side of the tongue you do have the Jumpman flight Ugh, get it fixed there I have seen some pairs have both Jumpman on both the left and the right shoe but I didn't get that fortunately. So very grateful for that. And then coming to the back of the shoe, you do have that Nike Air there. You know, something that a lot of OG collectors know and love. You have that on the back tab there. They do have a hidden message on the back of the tab. When you're supposed to read the left shoe first, it says, it's not about the shoes, dot, dot, dot. And then on the other one, it says, it's about where you're going. And then it has a signature there. I'm not exactly for sure on whose signature is, so don't crucify me in the comments. Outside of that, getting down to the midsole, you do have the black there with kind of an off-white, yellowish off-white there on the midsole. You do have that air unit at the bottom, like all most Jordan 4s. Flipping to the outer sole, you have the off-white bleeding onto the bottom. You do have hints of that violet or, or burgundy or whatever you want to call that on the back heel and the toe. Uh, with the Nike Air on the bottom. And then next up, I do want to get into the insole stitching. I have some B-roll to show that inside stitching there, but the inside stitching on the shoe does have a nice stitched in tab that says, inspired by street culture, fashion, and the greatest athlete in history, HO 2022. 
approved by Michael Jordan. I'm on my year with the logo. The whole insole is quilted on the outside that you would normally see from looking inside of the shoe and the very bottom, the one that you wouldn't see. The whole insole is gonna be in quilted. I haven't put these on my feet yet, but I know that I will. And I can just imagine that with the quality and the steps going into this shoe, that this is gonna be not your average Jordan 4 when it comes to comfort. Normally for comfort wise, this shoe would be normally uncomfortable, but with all of the quilted parts and materials that you do have on this shoe, hopefully it does make it a lot more comfortable. Now going on to the next part, we do have the laces here. It does match the whole overall of the shoe, but wanted to kind of talk about it because if you haven't already seen it, there have been a few people that have taken different laces from Amamayer Jordan 1s or the Amamayer Jordan 3s so it can match that off-white tone to match the laces. Y'all let me know in the comment section if that is something that you would do to this shoe if you were to get your hands on it I feel like it's not a bad idea might just do it myself who knows I have to try it out I'll probably do one of each one cream laced and then one with the original laces that it comes with but speaking about the other Jordan silhouettes I have I do have reviews on the channel for the threes me and my wife hit on that pair for retail you have the Jordan ones the Jordan twos the Jordan threes and the I'm on my year Jordan fours out of all of the four where do you have this one stacked at. I would say this is probably going to come second place for me if I was to go in order just based off of the Jordan 1 through 4 because they do have other silhouettes but just from Jordan's 1 through 4 made from I'm on my year I would say number one the three has to be at the top. I feel like it's the most wearable. The I'm on my year fours would definitely be my number two. Honestly, it may be an unpopular opinion. I would probably take the I'm on my year Jordan twos as my third place spot and the I'm on my year Jordan 1s as my fourth place spot. Y'all can get into the comment section. Y'all let me know where the, where you have them stacked up at. Outside of that, that is the I'm on my year Jordan 4s. Hopefully you were able to enjoy some of that B-roll that I provided for you. I'm gonna close this video out. Like I said, get inside the comment section. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell for all the upcoming videos that I might have coming out. It's December, Christmas is around the corner. Maybe you wanna pick this up for a personal pair for Christmas or for a loved one if you already hit for retail. Y'all get in the comment section, like I said. It's your boy Moody. I'm gonna have to go on and check out of here. Peace.